Chopper, 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 what's happening? Hey, tune in with your boy G by the juice, man. I know it's been a minute, bro. I know uh, I ain't been dropping no content, but I got stuff coming, man. We just been trying to get the cuddly squared away or whatnot. So, all right. If y'all watching this video, I'm sure I'm probably gonna post the other video. Y'all already know that the uh, motor dropped in the cutlass now. Everything, excuse me, good on that. Man, hold on, hold on, hold on. I forgot. Man, if you're new to the, if you're new to the channel and um, you're tuning in with me, man, hit that like button, man. Subscribe to the channel, share the channel, man. Um. Comment man if you like what you see, you know what I'm saying? Just keep keep rocking with me. We got more to come. But anyways, what I was saying was I'm still getting used to this uh YouTube stuff, y'all. So man, y'all bear with me, bro. It be days I be, you know what I'm saying, doing doing it good and some days I don't. But I mean I'm in good spirit. Hope everybody in good spirit. I ain't finna talk y'all do because I be hopping out sudden sometimes. But yeah, if you're watching this video, I'm sure I'm gonna post the other video. Y'all know that the motor and the cutlass now, everything good. We had one problem, bro. Now, they had to finish, you know what I'm saying, doing their little final touches or whatever, tweaking and tuning. But man, what about the radiator? God damn, I got a crack in it. And I'm like, bro, I'm trying to think. When that happened, man, cause like now I remember I just had put a put a I put a fuel pump on there not too long ago, and then I'm trying to figure out like I originally took it the to get the uh, the main, the rear main seal and transmission seal fixed cause it was leaking. So you know what I'm saying? When it's all said and done, it was like it was, my best bet was to get it rebuilt, and honestly. Yeah, I could have got an LS. I could have built the LS partially, you know what I'm saying, for what I paid for this. But man, this they did real good. I'm satisfied with it. You know what I'm saying? Um, the next one, I'm going to do something better. It's going to get better and better. Like I said, this is my first build, so you know, I'm kind of new to this. I'm just learning as I, as I go or whatever. Um, but yeah, anyway, the radiator it had cracked in it pretty much, long story short. A small little, it, it, I don't even want to say if it was a crack or not, it was just, it's leaking a little water, so. They said it was somewhere like from the well beating or whatever, I guess they had warped or something, I don't know. But anyway, that was slowing down the process, so I had to order a whole, a whole new uh, a radiator. No, because the one I got in there is, is the racing radiator with the dual fans and stuff, the aluminum radiator. So I had to order a whole another one. I mean, I had to wait pretty much. I don't know. I got it here in probably about maybe, maybe about five days or something like that. Maybe four days. So I got it. I got it back there. That's it right there in the box. So we finna head over here, man, and get this to them and see how long it's going to take us. Hey. I'm ready to goddamn get my car back, man. So I've been talking a little too much, but when I get there, man, I'm gonna cut y'all back on. But I just wanted to keep y'all look the motion was going on, man. So hey, keep rocking with your boy Juice, man. I got something else coming, man. And we just gonna keep going like that, man. If y'all got any comments, or, I mean any suggestions, man, let me know, man. Each one, teach one, man. Cause I. I I don't be knowing like I need some tires for it too. So tell me what type of tires would y'all suggest for it? Cause right now, you know, when once this process done, you know, we set up for paint. Uh I'ma go ahead and do that. But I gotta get the I gotta get four tires. They were telling me to go with uh some 17 inch tires. Cause I kinda want the tires thick like how my brother had his. So I got the dimensions in my in my phone. And uh, let me see what they told me. I'm gonna tell you, I want y'all to tell me these the same uh dimensions that was on the uh on that money Carlo that that was up there. If y'all seen that one, so the tires 
is a P245 60R15. So yeah, let me know. You know what I'm saying? That's good for the, for that cutlass. Because that's the same tire size that was on that money collar. That's a G body fit me. The size 17s though. So I was just gonna order some off tire tirerack.com and shit and do it like that. But yeah. Hey man. Back at it. Back at it at the shop. Just wanna show you how that Mustang, man. Clean. Clean little Mustang, man. Try to think of it. Good rich. Yes, sir. Yeah, I see it. Prestige. That thing nice, boy. Watch one. Yeah. So yeah, we just took the right head up here, man. They gonna get me right. Just wanted to show you how that. So that's what we got going on, man. That's what we got going on here. They ain't got nothing, nothing new in here. Going on, but so, yeah, I see the vibe. So I just wanted to show you how this. So I ain't got too much going on today. Just a little something. Hit that like button, that share. Subscribe to the channel, man. It's G by the Juice checking in. So it was just a little light, little, little vlog. It wasn't nothing too major. Just keeping y'all look up the post, man. So next time y'all see me, y'all gonna be seeing me in that in that G body. But yeah, don't forget hit the like button, share, subscribe to the channel, man. Send peace and positive vibes out there, man. Shout out to my boy Swag, man. Shout out to my aunt Sprayway, man. 87 is this boy, 78 Chevy boy. Ike. Shout out to the whole game, man. Send a little out there to everybody, man. Shout out to Wilt Addict, man. Y'all go follow my boy Greasy Wilts, man. Shout out to him too, man. Um Jayco. Holla at him too, man. So we out. So yeah man, I got exclusive access man. I'm gonna show y'all some more this LS swap. Oh goddamn ragged cutlass beautiful. Flat tire, yee, we need one jeepies. LS swap C10. Oh yeah, that's nice. That look good right there, Jay. Yeah, I see the butt ticks. Nice clean LS swap. Told y'all I need to Come holler at, holler at my brothers up here, man. They'll get you right. Good, honest work. How long it took y'all to do this one, Jay? Uh, this has been an ongoing project for a little while. Okay. Shit, but it turned out good. That's real good. Everything nice. Yep. Custom C10. Just want to show y'all that that y'all see what's going on. They fair what they gonna they gonna paint it. I don't know what the customer's gonna do yet. I don't know if he's gonna leave it like this or not. Yeah. We even put Dakota digital gauges in it. Oh, for real? New steering column. And look at the inside. Put Dakota digital dash in it. Look at the dash. Oh damn! Yeah, that shit look good as hell. It's nice there and well. Y'all see they do it all. Y'all need to come come holler at them. It's a good ass, it's a good body too. This this truck ain't in bad shape. Yes sir. Y'all come check them out, man. Hit the like button. Share. Subscribe to the channel. Tap back in with y'all. If I got some more. Alright. Got to get a new radiator in. My boy Sebastian got me in there. In there like swimwear. Well. So y'all see the motor. They did a good job up here. Know y'all ready to hear it running. 
just something light. You just gotta, gotta rebuild new. Biggest mile can, deltas, all that. Chinese for lunch. Okay, good. I'm not having it tonight then. <laughs> I knew that answered the question for what I needed. Say so you ain't having it two that two time. I don't think. Fucking Chinese every now and then, not bad, man. Every fucking day. Shit. You will never have a solid shit a day in your life. Nah. <laughs> that, that shit ain't no damn good in it, damn way. Not good for you, I'll tell you that much. Shit, I, I've been fucking them damn hot wings up over there by the Publix next to the Chinese place. Uh, uh, right there on Mirror Lake. What's it called? By the, uh, I can't, oh, WNB. Oh, WNB? Yeah. Oh, up here? Yeah. You live close by here? Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. I stay by the Walmart. Oh, oh, oh. You stay close by too? I'm on Ridge. Who? Ridge Road. I don't know it. You know I ain't from here. Oh, oh, all right, yeah. so you go up here, make a right. That's Ridge Road. You know where there's, there's a roundabout and a shell? Yeah, yeah if you go down this road on the right. It's another roundabout? There's a roundabout right up here, yeah. As soon as you go up here to the light, you make a right. You go down that way like you're heading towards Kroger. I didn't even know there was no Kroger up here. Oh. <laughs> up this way. Is it? Yeah, it's not far, man. Damn. I need it because I, I like Kroger. Shit better than Walmart. Walmart. I go to the one because I live up uh, for Oak Mountain. Yeah. So, yeah, I go to Kroger. Damn. When I leave here, I'm going to go that way then. Yep. Oh yeah, shit. I, my partner came over and did put that shit in. He fuck with. He built LS motors and shit. Well, I, yeah, my partner friend. I don't. Insulation so fucking big on this shit. Yeah. I can take that shit back. Switch it out for something else. <clears throat> yeah, them aluminum radiators, man, I guess they last for what you pay for them. <laughs> they last for what you pay for them. But I'm show sure y'all, man, y'all ain't seen the pictures in depth. In depth. So, clean, you know, it ain't bad. That sheet, we'll probably just get that shampoo. Carpet, new carpet, dash pad, and go over that. That ain't nothing. Get the headliner, get that seat done, touched up, and this shit. So, yeah, that's the flowers. I just want to show y'all. Got a little rest right there at the bottom. But the flow pans are good. At the top. Got a little rest. Yeah. So you got a good bed in it. So I'm going to see what my boy Tony can do with that. I don't know. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to get a new dough. Let me know. I don't know. A little rest. Council. 
Hopefully not, man. Hopefully we ain't gonna get nothing. But everything else, though, the jam's in good shape. Everything else. And it was just a little bit right there. But battery going dead. So, holla at y'all next. Catch y'all in a bit. Don't forget to hit the like button, share, subscribe to the channel, man. You know, y'all seen it. Y'all seen that Mustang 69 Mustang, man. Clean. <laughs> yes, sir. We in the fan zone. Working. They working? Yes, sir. Let y'all hear it. That dirt, that dirt, that cooling in, man. It's out now, though. Put some clean shit in. Clean y'all shit out. We getting now. We making progress. I already know it. Hit that like button. Sure, subscribe to the channel. Here we go. What y'all been waiting on? Now you got they tell you this this ain't your battery. Now I can tell. Yeah. I was wondering, I was like, dang it. Is is that it? Still got the exhaust leak, so what we gonna do about that, man? I'm not even finna worry about that right now. So that's I'm gonna have to buy a new set of headers. So the other head, the headers that I had on there, what it was, I couldn't get that back screw on when I had put them things on a while ago or whatever. And uh, dang y'all, hold on, gotta close this thing. See, I can't, um, I couldn't get that back screw tightened out of the way. So, so what's done happened was, um, it's done warping. So it's not caused to have an exhaust leak. So I'm gonna end up having to get some new headers, but I ain't finna worry about it right now. I'm gonna enjoy the car. I can always, you know what I'm saying, get that done. Um, what else I'm gonna update y'all? I try to get them to fix the seat, so the seat motor work. I need y'all help with this. The seat motor is working, you know what I'm saying, but it's not moving. Let me know in the comment uh, section, man, what do I need to do about that? I don't know if it's the coupling uh, piece or what, but yeah, that's what we got going on. I'm trying to figure that out. We got big things coming, man. I stay tuned to the G-Bike, man. I 
appreciate y'all for rocking with me, man. Before we go, hit the like button, share, subscribe to the channel, man, and then I'll come back at y'all with something different. Hopefully, man, they, they gotta adjust the carb and all that stuff. So I'll probably have it back next week. Today, Friday, the second of uh, June. So hopefully by next week we'll have it back. But until then, man, appreciate y'all. Keep rocking with your boy, man. Send peace and positivity throughout the universe. Gone.